These are certainly dark days for the United States and the future of the United States, but uh, they remain permanently dark, it seems, uh, for, the glo for the planet. The giant on the beach that, that has been out there waiting. Uh, anyway, a couple things I want to say. One, my background is Swedish, and, and I never feel too much like, like a Viking, really. But sometimes uh, I've heard of an expression called bloodlust, and I think I feel that. Maybe everybody does. Sometimes you can, once a fight begins, you can just really get into the fight. I had a, <coughs> a, uh, a colleague who taught English beside me at the middle school. He was a helicopter pilot, uh, served in uh, the uh, Korean War, and uh, I, I liked the man a lot. And he, he once had said uh, that he, he'd walk a mile to avoid a fight. But once a fight started, well, you just had to get into it. Uh, and maybe that's what I'm talking about. I don't know. That was one thing. I, 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 I feel bloodlust at times seeing what's going on. Uh, What's imminent right now is Black Friday. It's only like three days away. And so uh, what I want to just do today is share with you two links uh, of Americans, a, a white woman in, in one of the links and a black woman in the other link uh, who is then uh, responded to by a black man. I, 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 can't, I can't quite figure out what, I can't figure out where that black guy, man is coming from. But in any case, you can see it's a wide open discussion among some communities now about what about this business of Black Friday. So I'll give you the links. Bye for now.